I know the ops they watch you. Run up on me, you bleeding. Wiping his nose, he's sneezing. He lost his bro, he grieving. His bro in the street, he slaughtered. The cops ain't find a call. Yo, man, what's going on, man? It's your boy Jordan B, man, and I'm back with another video, man. Welcome to another fucking video, man. Welcome to a motherfucking video. Yeah. Man, it's been 13 motherfucking days, y'all. It's been 13 days since I posted a video. It's been 13 days since I posted a video, y'all. Today, today's video, as you can see by the title, I am going to be telling y'all the story of me losing my virginity. And I know everybody, some people actually w really wanted to hear the story, and I ain't really want to tell it because it's like, it's none of y'all business. But I'm gonna go ahead and just say my go ahead and get my story started. So one day, <clears throat> one day I told this girl to pull up, man. She was supposed to be coming over and shit. She was like, nah, 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 nah. She was like, fuck all that, come to my house type shit. So I'm like, okay, cool, shit. You want me to come to your house? I'm gonna come here. I'm gonna go, shit. You know what I'm saying? So I so I go over there. Her dad over there. I ain't know her dad was over there. She didn't say nothing. So dad shook my hand. He was like, how you doing, young fella? I was like, my name Jordan. He was like, my name David. Ooh, I probably should not say her dad's name, but it's too late. Uh, her name, her, his name was David. So, uh, you know, we met. Woo, 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 woo. He had to go to work. So he was like, uh, your mom, shit. <laughs> I'm acting like I'm the dad. He was like, the mom is upstairs asleep, basically. So I was like, okay, cool, cool, cool. Cool. I'm, we, you know, we chilling on the couch. I'm over here acting like I'm fake sleep, but I hear him. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm playing it off like I'm fake sleep. Like, so he'll make me stay tight shit. So, cause he, he had a heart. I ain't gonna cap. He had a, he had some type of heart. I ain't gonna cap. And she was, uh, the girl I was talking to, she was like, he sleep. He was like, uh, when he get up, um, we got food in the refrigerator and stuff for him and stuff. I was like, oh, this nigga a cool dad. In my head, I'm like, oh, this nigga got a cool motherfucking dad, bro. This I like this nigga. I like this nigga right here. So, dad left. Uh, mom was still asleep. Uh, she ain't had no siblings there. They was at the grandma house. So, I was actually really dozing all type shit. Like, I was like, I was really like dozing off. And girl, like, like, open, like, she pulled down the, you know what I'm saying? Like she got busy, so I'm like, I'm like, whoa, I'm awake, I'm awake, and like I'm, a, I'm like, oh shit, you know what I'm saying? So I'm like, damn, I ain't gonna catch yet, <laughs> man. So I was just like, damn. But after that, she wanted to, she wanted to, you know what I'm saying? And I'm like, I'm like, damn, she trying to, she trying to, she trying to take me up through this. So I'm like. I'm like, oh shit, I ain't got no, I ain't got no condoms on me. She was like, that's fine, that's fine. I was like, no, 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 that's not fine. I'm not gonna go through that shit. I'm not gonna have no kids, my nigga. So she can drive. So we went, I rode where we went up to Walgreens. It was like 10 a.m., not not 10 a.m., 10 p.m. at night. I drove up to Walgreens, went in there, got a box of condoms. They wanted some ID. Luckily, she was motherfucking uh, 19. So I'm like, okay, cool, cool. Cause I was like, I was like, 18, yeah, I was 18, she was 19, so I'm like, okay, cool, do you got an ID? Because, you know, some people don't have their driver's license, they don't have no, you know, any type of ID at that age, so I'm like, okay, do she got her ID? Because she never talked about this shit, so I'm like, okay, cool, she got the ID, so gave her the ID, bought the condoms, go back to her crib, I'm talking about it was a big-ass pack, it was a fat-ass pack, um, slid it on, went to her, I don't know, was that her room or her sister's room? I think it was her room. I think it was her room. So we went to her room, and she was like, you hear that? I was like, hear what? Didn't know that dad was coming back. Dude was gone for like 20 minutes, bro. I'm like, why is he coming back? So I hear him walking walking up the porch, because you can hear it. Like, she got them little stone porch, uh, them stone uh, thingies, them little staircases, porches that go up. And I'm like, I hear this nigga. She's like, bro, no. I'm like, no, I hear this nigga. I'm, no, I'm not tripping. So I heard the key unlock. Bro, and I tell you, I sprinted down so fucking fast, bro. I has, bro, I jumped down the stairs, bro. I hopped on the couch. I went right back to sleep, bro. He came in. He was like, uh, forgot my, um, what did he say? He said he forgot something. And he was like, uh, he, he took a look at me. Um, I went upstairs. 
the reason I know he took a look at me is because when he left, she said he was looking, he was looking at you, make sure I'm still asleep. So I was like, okay, cool, cool, cool. So I'm sitting down that bit asleep. I'm gonna whatever not out. At, I'm, I'm talking about I'm the best motherfucker, bro. My childish ass be playing. Like I be play sleeping, bro. I ain't gonna cap. Niggas be coming home. Like I be rock, bro. I be knocked out. So he came, he got his shit. I heard him upstairs. He was like, "What you doing up here?" And she was like, "Oh, I just came upstairs because he went to sleep downstairs." And he was, he was like, "That's my girl." And I was like, "Hey, twin, <laughs> I don't think you know your daughter that well." <laughs> so he left. She uh texted me to come back upstairs. I, I ran back up there, nigga. Fuck you, talking about? I ran back up there, got in the bed and all. Oh, boy, we, you know we doing our thing. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna lie, I hit. You know what I'm saying? That shit was good, but um, her mom, I heard the mom waking up, using the bathroom and shit, and I'm like, you hear that? Like, we in the middle of it. Like, we, like she, she on top. I'm like, you hear that? She's like, no, I don't hear that. I'm like, bro, come on now. I hear, come on now. I've been hearing shit all night, my nigga. Like, my black, my black instincts are on fire, nigga. Like, I'm looking everywhere. I'm like, bro, so she like, I hear it too. When I tell you she like got it up, when she, the moment she got up, I don't, bro, I can't even say it on YouTube, but it made it, like when she got up, like out of it, like when I got out of it, it made a sound. Like, and that was loud as fuck. Like it was like, and I was like, so her, so her mom coming, so her mom came out the room and was like, I can't say the I can't say the girl name, but she was like, ah, ah, "Are you okay? What's going on?" So she walked in there. I'm behind the door. Her mother, like, I'm glad she ain't like slammed the door open because she usually do that in her room. Like she slams the door open, so she pushed it open a little bit, and the door was flying behind me just like this, bro. And I'm like, "Oh my god!" I'm like, "Oh my fucking god, bro!" I'm tripping. So I'm like, "I'm like, okay." And she walked like right here to the door, and I'm like. I'm telling my heart beating fast as fuck. She was like, where's that boy at? She was like, he downstairs sleeping. I'm like, why the fuck would you, I'm like, where the fuck would you lie? Why, why would you lie? You know what I'm saying? Like, why, would, why the fuck would you lie? So she goes downstairs and luckily, 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 she has this uh, downstairs where you go downstairs. There's a room on the right, like the living room. And then there's a room on the left that goes back and that's where I was like that's where the couch was so as she went down there thank god her steps don't make no noise bro I was tiptoeing down that motherfucker <laughs> going and then I guess the daughter followed her because she went downstairs too bro. but she didn't she wasn't behind me when I when I went to the couch she wasn't behind me so I'm, I'm you know me I'm back on that motherfucker I'm back on that motherfucker I the fuck out so her, her mom came and she was like oh but the daughter was with her. I ain't know the daughter went with her. I thought she just, you know, came downstairs and went back up. So she came downstairs. She was like, oh, look at him. She was like, do you need any food? You know, blah, 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 blah. She was like, uh, dad told told me to, uh, when he wake up, you know, cook him something. She was like, okay, okay. So her mom went back upstairs. Closed the door. This girl, wild as fuck. I ain't going to cap this girl wild as fuck. She came back on the mother. She, she didn't even want to go upstairs, my nigga. She came on the couch. And got busy. And I'm like, oh, pants all, bro. My jogging pants are, like, on the inside wet. And I'm like, bro, I cannot move, bro. I am, nigga, it's, it's all wet. And so I'm like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. So she come back downstairs. We on the couch. She just going crazy, going crazy, going crazy. I'm like, okay, cool, 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 cool. After that, we was done. We was done. I thought we was done. I'm sleeping. We both sleep. Tell me why. Tell me why she wake me up in the middle of my sleep, bro. Like she didn't even say, you know, let's do the, let's whoop the whoop type shit. She said it. Took took the shorts off. It just went crazy. And I'm like, I ain't never experienced that shit in my life. So I'm like, oh my god. I'm like, bro, what the fuck going on, bro? I'm 18. I don't know what the fuck going on. I'm like, bro, that shit was that shit was good. I ain't gonna cap. But next day, <laughs> next day come. Y'all ain't gonna believe this shit. Next day come, bro. Dad came home from work. Cause you know, he get off in the afternoon. Like, what was that, like 12, one ish? He came back home. 
open the door. Um, condom. What was it? I th yeah, the condom wrapper got, like, it was on the steps. So the dad, like, who who condom is this? Who condom is this? Who's taking condoms out of my thing? And I'm like, nigga, I didn't even know he had condoms. And he was like, yo, man, come here. And I'm like, yeah. And he was like, he was like, you been, you been, you been fucking my daughter? And I'm like, nah, no, sir. I said, why would you ever think that, bro? I'm like, I'm, I'm asleep. Like, what are you, what are you, come on, man. Y'all wouldn't do no shit like that. He was like, you promised me, bro. He was like, you promised me? Are you bullshitting me right now, bro? Are you bullshitting me? And I was like, bro, come on, bro. That's me, bro. I, ain't, I said, I ain't gonna do no shit like that, bro. I, I was sitting there knocked out. I don't know if y'all saw me or not, but I was knocked out yesterday. He was like, yeah, y'all would not doubt. I probably just dropped it on the way out. Because he had, I ain't even know this nigga had condoms in his wallet. I'm like, what the fuck? That's how I learned to keep condoms in my wallet sometimes. So I'm like, every, you know, everywhere I go, a party or something, you never know what happens like shit. So, dude, come in this. Um, little brother come home, bro. Nigga went, bro, this nigga is stupid, bro. This nigga went upstairs. Her little brother went upstairs into her room because she saw that I was over. I mean, he saw that I was over. So, this, all you heard was, it's smell in here. And luckily, the parents did not hear it. So, we run back upstairs because we heard it. We like, bro, what the fuck are you doing? He was like, y'all niggas in here fucking. And I was like, bro, you got to chill, bro. You got to chill. He like, nah, y'all in here fucking. Y'all was in here fucking with y'all. I was like, bro, no, bro. I said, I don't know what you're talking about, bro. Bro, this nigga went, bro, this nigga went to his dad. She went to her dad. Well, his dad, her dad. And she was like, he was like, dad, dad, dad. Come in the room, come in the room. So he come in the room. <laughs> he come in the room. This shit was embarrassing. He come in the room. And he smelled it. He was like, I don't smell nothing. He was like, you last smell your dirty ass coming from basketball practice and being clean. That's the only thing I smell. And I was, bro, my heart was like, oh my God, thank God, bro. But after that, mom pulled up. She called me. I said, all right, cool. We gone. Gave her a kiss and I was gone, bro. That shit was wild, bro. That shit was, that was a, that was a wild ass story. But shit, I just, I just had to vent to y'all real quick about that, bro. I had to tell y'all about that. I had to tell y'all about my first experience, bro. That shit was crazy. But, man, if y'all like this video, man, give it a thumbs up. Like the video. Subscribe to my channel and leave a comment in the description and let me know how you think the story, like, how was the story to y'all? Like, how did that shit go, bro? Because that shit was a crazy-ass story, bro. And let me know, should I do more stories like this? Because I, I got moved. I got moved. So, just let me know, bro. Like, I don't want y'all to think I'm no hoe or nothing, bro. My, uh... My whole body count was three people, bro. Don't be thinking I'm no hoe. My whole body count was three people, and that was the people I went out with. So don't be thinking I'm no, you know what I'm saying? Don't be thinking I'm no. I had some wild shit done to me. Like, I ain't, I ain't fuck them, no, but I had some wild shit done to me. You know what I'm saying? So it's like I got more stories type shit. But, man, y'all go ahead and like, comment, subscribe, and hit that bell to be notified whenever I post, man. It will notify you whenever I post, man. It's your boy Jordan B, man, and we gone. Wiping his nose, he's nizzing. He lost his bro, he grieving. He's born in the street, he slaughtered. The cops ain't find a call, bro. Now he's mad at nothing, mad at nothing.